Hey guys, this is DV with another Lightworks tutorial. In this Lightworks tutorial segment, we're going to be discussing chroma keying and green screen keying within the Lightworks beta program. So to get started here, we've imported our video clips that we're going to need, and we've placed them in a permanent bin. This process is discussed in the previous tutorial if you're curious on how to accomplish that. So the first thing now that we want to do is go ahead and open up a new edit, which is edit 11, and it opens up a new window. We want to go ahead and drag our green screen cropped layer um, into the edit window, just like that. Um, we crop this just using a mask, the mask tool in Vegas Pro, just to cut it down to make it um, a little bit different because our original clip had, had all this um, lighting and stuff off to the side. So we just wanted to kind of clean that up and just have the green layer that we needed. I didn't really want to mess around with this in Lightworks because I just wanted to get this tutorial done because a couple of people had requested it via YouTube and I just wanted to get something up there um, for everybody to actually learn how to do the green screen effect not all this extra stuff with masks. Although it's probably possible in this program I just haven't gotten a chance to try it out. So what we want to go ahead and do next is add another video layer right um, below video layer 1. So what we do is we right click on the timeline, click add tracks, select the number of tracks to add, which we just want one video track. Um, we'll just leave the name automatic and our location is going to be after V1, so that way it's located between V1 and Audio 1. Click on do it, and then that opens up the track that we need. Now the next thing that we have to do is to um, set our in and out points on the timeline for our background image, or video clip in this case. So we do video in and video out actually video out is going to go all the way at the end okay and then what we want to do is prepare our background video um, or image so we're going to turn off video clip one popping this out here selecting our in and out points so we're just going to clear those in and out and then we're just going to leave this right here and all we're going to do is press alt Alt V and it's going to place it right onto the timeline. Okay, so now your green screen background layer is selected. You want to go ahead and turn that off and turn on your green screen layer on the timeline. You click on the effects tab and then you can select the green screen key for the current clip. Then you have a bunch of different options that open up. You can use the eyedropper tool just to select your green color and then you can use its saturation, hue, and luminance uh, tools just to make some adjustments and gradually your video will become clearer and the background will be able to be see-through through the green screen. Um, and then you can also adjust your spill um, suppression and also adjust the key smoothness which will really make um, the video look more realistic because it will smooth out the edges on your green screen clip like around the shirt. So basically you really have a good effect here. You can zoom out on the timeline, turn your layers on, and then you're ready to render your video. Hopefully this helped you guys out who had questions about um, green screen and chroma key in Lightworks. And um, subscribe to stay tuned for our next tutorial. Thanks guys.